Hello YouTube, Vintage Sterling Finds here with Meeker's Adventures. Notice first guy to always comment on the videos and yeah. look, somebody even shaved well, today. Yeah, I know, right? Well, considering he's cutting my grass, you know, what can I say? I got hey, a bragging rights. we're not in his town anymore. Oh, well, you know, technically this use is now part of the city, even though at one time it wasn't. So today we're in a wealthy area. We're going to hit maybe five thrift stores, me and my sidekick, and um, hopefully we get lucky today. Let's get to it. Woo! Remember, like, share subscribe. And, share and subscribe. I'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers. Anything you like is gonna be on my um, Etsy store. Link in the descriptions. Let's get into so it. So we're at the first one. A little bit of a high value area. We're gonna try to film, no guarantees. They're gonna probably ask for my bag. This store is pretty um, strict with the rules. Even though it's an upscale area. So let's try our best and hopefully we'll get you guys some good footage. One dollar. For two dollars kind of cool keep this one this is kind of cool there's this then it's a uh, Splenda pick that one up for sure kind of a beaded old necklace kind of cool some jewelry here some jewelry here so the last looking. store they're very very strict they were hovering some old women so um now we're gonna go to the second store um I'll show you guys the, Here's second, the second one, one. Um, they're more chill in here so um we should be fine so uh, let's get into it. Yeah, so we're just walking around. Um, this one's a little bit bigger. Just seeing what they have. A lot of housewares, but we'll go to the jewelry section in a bit. See if they have watches. Watches here are a bit expensive, but we'll see how it goes. So we're here now and there's tons of jewelry, but we've looked through it and the prices are very, very steep. So we're trying to find diamonds in the rough, but we're not having any luck. Cause see here's some silver, but it's like silver earrings, 30, um, 15. Silver necklace is um, 30. So as you can see the prices here are quite, quite high. Silver rings, 14, $15. Yeah, there's no money in that. No, I think, let's go see if we can find Jordan. We looked here, these are the junk bags I got before. It's still nothing. See anything you like, Jordan? It's $14 though, but still, it's kind of nice. Is there anything in it? No, it's just hmm. tin. That's not tin. Small tins. How much is the queen tin? $10. It's from, it's from the 50s. That's you can tell. I know. Yeah. Issue is everybody collected those, yeah, right? Okay. It's old. Mm -hmm. So probably I'd say this. Mm -hmm. 50s. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 50s. Everybody the kept point. those, so they're not that collectible. Yeah. That's unfortunate. See anything, Jordan? No. Some utensils, but nothing... Um, Amazing, because you never these could be old, but nothing good. So yeah, so the last thrift store was a bust. They um everything was super super overpriced. So uh, me and Jordan both struck out. Now we're gonna try the other thrift store up here. Then we have two more after this. So hoping we get lucky. Um, this thrift store may be hard to film because a lot of these love bumping copyrighted music. But you never know. Found one nice swatch aluminum. I'll show that to you guys in a bit. Um, they're bumping Backstreet Boys, so we have to be very careful of how long these videos go for. Just following Jordan so now. So we did okay at that thrift store. We got a swatch irony, all steel, uh, nine bucks, uh, 1995 model. Polish it up, clean it up. It's probably $120 watch all day long. These things sell fast, especially the um, all stainless ones like this. Um, last thrift store we couldn't film much in. They were just bumping um, Backstreet Boys and copyrighted music. So let's go on to the next so, one. Next one's over here. It's a newer one, kind of a pop-up. Um, haven't had much luck here in the past. A limited selection, um, a kind of expensive, but hopefully today's the day we get lucky. So we got a couple of silvers, three. This one's a couple bucks. This one's a buck, the nicest, the bracelet here. When I get home, we'll do a bit nicer of a thing. As you can see, they got a fair bit of jewelry. First time buying something, but uh, scrap box, some other stuff. Not a bad 
looked like. Okay, we're on our way to the last thrift store of the day. This is the one I got the watch straps on a month ago. So we're hoping this one's gonna be a banger, right, Jordan? Yep. So we'll try to film best we can and see how it goes. So here's something that's really cool. It's an Agnew Art Deco watch. It does work. Um, 14K reinforced. It's beautiful movement, beautiful shape. It ticks like a hot damn. I paid $30. Now I've sold watches like these for a couple hundred. I haven't been able to find it on eBay yet. So I'm um, hoping for a good score. But um, that's going to be the last thrift store. Now let's go home and we'll have a wrap up video at home.